Welcome to Tech for Learners. In this tutorial, we will see how to install Nginx Web Server in our Oracle Cloud Linux instance. We have created the Oracle Linux server in our previous video. You remember that instance is always free to run. If you haven't created the server yet, please watch that video and create the server. Also, download and install Mobaxtem SSH client. Since I have created the server already, I will not do that. Open the Mobaxtem SSH client and connect to the server using private key. Enter the command sudo m install nginx. We are getting no package nginx available error, so nginx package is not available in the repository. To fix this, we need to install epel repository for Linux. epel is nothing but extra packages for enterprise Linux. To install epel, use the following command sudo m install and the URL of EPEL package. I will give this command in the description. Once it's done, we can install the Nginx package. Now use the command sudo m install Nginx. Wait for a minute. Nginx is successfully installed now. We need to start the Nginx server. Also, we need to make this as a service so that Nginx will be started automatically when system restarts. No need to start the Nginx server manually in case of system restart. Use the command sudo systemctl enable hyphen hyphen now Nginx service. Now Nginx service is created and started. The service starts a web server that listens on TCP port 80 by default. To check the status of the service, run the following command. sudo systemctl status nginx. It's showing active and running. Next, we need to open the firewall port for the nginx web service. By default, it runs on 80. Use the command sudo firewall hyphen cmd hyphen hyphen add hyphen service http permanent. Once it's done, we need to reload the firewall configuration using the command sudo firewall hyphen cmd hyphen hyphen reload. That's it. We have successfully installed and configured Nginx server in Linux compute instance. Now go to your browser and type the IP address of your Linux instance in URL and press enter. You can see default page of Nginx server. This HTML page is loaded from user share Nginx HTML folder. We can edit this file to see whether changes are reflected here. So go to SSH client and cd into users share Nginx HTML folder. Open the index.html file using Vim editor and make some changes to the file.
Here I am removing few lines from HTML file. Save the file after the change. Now go back to browser and refresh. We can see the changes are reflecting. We will be able to access this server from anywhere using this public IP address. Now we are accessing this using HTTP method. In our next video, we will see how to access the website using HTTPS encryption. Thanks for watching this video. Please subscribe and share my channel and click the bell icon to get the notification for future videos.